Welcome back to the Green Means Go channel. It's your host, me, and today I am excited because we are here to do a quick review of Dark Horse Odds. Now, Dark Horse Odds is a tool that I've used for about two years on my sports betting journey and a tool that I think new bettors and old bettors can get some value from. So let's go ahead and jump into what Dark Horse Odds is all about. Now, before we get into my favorite features about Dark Horse, let me answer the question that everyone has. How much does this cost to use? It is $39 a month. Compare that to the competitor, which is Odds Jam, which costs, yeah, $200. Now, I have nothing bad to say about Odds Jam. It's a, it's a good service. However, it's for two different markets. Um, Dark Horse tends to target the audience who is here to make a for sure profit and is okay with taking small wins that they can compound and build over time. Whereas Odds Jam targets the more risk tolerant people, people who want to positive EV bet and wager large sums of money and kind of ride that roller coaster. So I prefer to take my small wins and watch it compound. So this is $40 a month. It does offer a two-day free trial and $30 off your first month. I'm telling you, it's worth the $39 to me, but it's for sure worth the $9 for 30-some days that you would get this for. I guarantee you'll make that $9 back just using these tools. Let's check them out. We'll start here with something that's a little bit vanilla, but probably one of the coolest features is just simply the odds table. I know I'm beating a dead horse here, but... Guys, if you only use FanDuel, if you only use DraftKings, you're just hurting yourself. Please sign up for all the sports books. Please make sure you're getting the best lines. You're only hurting yourself in the long run if you do not. So let's say tonight we're interested in taking Jason Hayward to hit a home run uh, because we think he's going to eat Zach Gallon alive. Quick side note here, the night I filmed that, Jason Hayward did actually hit a home run. So sorry I didn't put that out uh, earlier. Um, side note that I did not include in the original video that I think is worth mentioning. These sort features are super helpful. I know there's a lot of clutter here when you type in Jason Hayward because you have over one and a half, over two and a half. If you go up here to totals, you can sort it by equals 0.5 and now it gets rid of some of that clutter. Um, you can do that for all kinds of stuff. Maybe you just want, uh, you know, a certain team when you're looking up a person. Uh, I know when I look up team slates. I like this function over here because I can sort by first half, first quarter, um, first five innings, that kind of thing. So do not forget to utilize these uh, features up here. They're a little bit hidden, but they are super helpful. If we scroll down here, we can see that Jason Hayward's home run is being offered for $650 on Barstool and $750 on FanDuel. What does that mean? It means if you have $100 units Okay, and hypothetically, you're playing this bet at $100. You bet it on Barstool, you bet it on FanDuel. You're going to make $100 more had you bet it on FanDuel and he hits one than on Barstool or MGM or DraftKings, right? So these are things that I think people get in the habit of just placing bets and they forget how much value they're losing by not checking this out. Uh, you can sort by Lee, you can sort by different markets, you can have a search function, super easy to use, very adaptable, um, and quite possibly one of the most useful and practical things offered on this site. Another great tool that they offer that nobody else offers, not even Odds Jam, is a profit boost finder. DraftKings and FanDuel, Caesars give out profit boosts all the time. You know, here's a 50% profit boost on the MLB. So what you can do is go up here to DraftKings. They've been giving these out like candy over the last few days. Um, and most of them are 50%. My max bet is 10 bucks, but I know a lot of you watching this video probably have a 25 or $50 max bet. We'll go conservative here and just say 25. You could submit this and okay, I'm going to filter this by MLB to show you tomorrow. There'll be a lot more. Um, there's not that many games left, so just humor me here, but it does have a cool filter feature. So if you want to make $7.75 guaranteed tonight, sorry about that. Let me just flip that on here. Okay, if you want to make a guaranteed $7.75 tonight, you will boost Julio Rodriguez to have an RBI on DraftKings, you'll put your 50% profit boost, you'll bet your 25, and then you'll go over to bar, uh, Bet Rivers or Unibet or any other Canby book, and you'll bet $56 on his under. No matter what happens, you're profiting $7, all right? Now, you may say, $7, I, I don't need, $7, they offer this every day. So in a week's time, you're making 40 bucks, okay? 
you going to turn 40 bucks down? If I said, Hey, I'll give you 40 bucks in a week. Are you going to say, no, thank you. Guess what? You just paid for your month subscription with just the profit boost tool. So, and again, this is at 9 17 PM. These profit boosts are much higher, a much larger percentage earlier on the day when you have the full slate to choose from. So uh, again, this is customizable as well. Super easy to use, very straightforward and user friendly. I know I said this was a repeating promo, so it also bears mentioning something I forgot when I first filmed this video, that if you have all your filters set for, say, a Monday, uh, DraftKings, MLB only, 50% profit boost, you can go up here and hit this Save button, and you can name this DraftKings MLB Boost, and you can hit Save. And guess what? Now, when you come back on Tuesday, when you come back on Wednesday, when you come back on Thursday, you can just come over here and click that thing, and you don't have to go through and adjust every single uh, feature to match the profit boost because it's already saved in your profile. The last tool I want to talk about is just a tale as old as time. We're talking the free bet finder. Guys, guys, convert your free bets, especially, especially the ones that you are risking at the beginning and they are returned to you. I'm just going to put some math on the screen for you right here. Let's say you have a promotion. Um, bet a home run hitter 25 bucks he doesn't hit a home run you get your bet back your effective odds if you convert your free bets go up so much more on your original wager what i mean by that is this and i'm just going to flip over to an odds calculator here to show you what i mean so as I was saying, let's say you have a risk-free $25 bet, you lose, it'll be refunded as a free bet to you, and you want to bet a long shot home run. I'm talking a 10 to 1, you know, uh, Stephen Kwan for the Guardians, okay? You bet that $25 to pay $275. Great. But you have insurance on this bet, meaning the book is going to give you back a $25 free bet if it loses. Now, if you're converting your free bets, and I always like to say you can get 75, 80%, we're going to call it 80% for this video. If you know you're going to get 80% back, $20 back, no matter what happens, if you convert, you're really only risking $5. So let's remember this, right? 275. Let's go ahead and plug in $5, which you're actually going to be losing. Now, what does your odds need to be to equal that 275? Well, I'll show you. You're essentially getting the Stephen Kwan bet at 54 to 1 odds. Okay, if you want to talk about expected value, if you want to talk about making a bet with tremendous long-term positive ROI, what else do I need to tell you? Okay, that is why. I always convert my free bets because in my head, I'm not risking 25 to win 275. I'm risking five to win 275, which effectively five times my odds. So that is why I convert my free bets. So let's say I bet Stephen Kwan for 25 bucks. He doesn't hit one. I go over here to FanDuel and I want to make that money back. I can see that if tomorrow... Um, I bet on this fella here for the U.S. Open, and I put my $25 on him. I just need to go put $183 on Garfia over here on Unibet or Bet Rivers, and I will get back $22. Oh, what do you know? If I'm converting at 87% here, I'm only risking $3. What do I need? To, what are my effective odds if I'm only risking $3? 7 to 1? More. Okay. 75 to 1? All right. More. You see, you see what I'm saying here. Okay. 80 to 1. Guess what? It's more. I mean, in 85 games, you don't think Stephen Kwan is going to hit a home run? That's what I mean by the value in converting your free bets. Please, guys, please just convert your free bets. So that is a quick look at Dark Horse Odds. Again, they do have a two-day free trial and $9 for your first month. I think I showed you in the last five minutes how that $9 can be returned back to your bank account uh, pretty easily. So check out Dark Horse Odds. If you want to do so, I have a link down here in the description and in the comments. Uh, click on that link. It'll take you right to a sign up page. As always, thank you for stopping by. If you have any questions about Dark Horse or anything sports betting, always happy to help you guys out and answer those. Take care and we will see you next time on the channel.